Well, the wind uh, caused a tree to topple in central Phoenix as well. This one hit an apartment building and Whitney Clark is live at this senior 12th and Highland to tell us what happened there, Whitney. Jared, the sun is out where we are right now, but we want to give you an, a look kind of at just how powerful this storm was when it swept through this uh, area earlier today. Take a look. You can see this palm tree snapped off of its base and then just up here, it went directly into the apartment building of a man named George Childs. Now, thankfully, he is okay, and so is his dog. Now, what you're seeing here, actually, the tree fell directly into his bedroom right over his bed. He had actually been sitting on it just moments before. The first thing he noticed, of course, was the sound and glass breaking. He has an extremely positive attitude right now. Take a listen to his reaction. I'm ecstatic. <laughs> I am ecstatic. Um, I have to thank the God above for, for saving me on that one because who knows if I was laying in the bed, who knows what could have happened. Where do you want me to stand? Well, here's a look actually at the damage from the inside of his home. There was debris, wood and insulation just everywhere. George has already talked to the property manager and they are actually working on getting him into a different unit for the time being. Now we've been out here for, you know, maybe 30 or 45 minutes or so. No clue as to when they're actually going to remove the tree. Now the people who live here tell me this happened just before two o'clock. It was incredibly loud. It was the wind that they really heard first and the tree following falling into the apartment sounded kind of like a car crash with all of that glass breaking. But again, thankfully, the people who live here are okay.